Josh here with CoinMiningRigs.com. We're going to show you how to build a 6 GPU mining rig. And as you can see, this is just a uh, crate, as I like to call it, that will hold all of the components. The primary components in this 6 GPU mining rig are going to be your motherboard. And as you can see, I've chosen the Z170A SLI Plus motherboard. And over here we have the GeForce GTX 1070 and uh, I like the Gigabyte it has uh, a dual fan design let me just show you what that looks like so you can see it's got the dual fan design here next we have the processor you just basically want a cheap processor that's compatible with whatever motherboard you've chosen this is a Celeron uh, G3900 uh, and it's compatible with the LGA 1151 chipset which the Z170A SLI Plus uses I like to just install wireless just to make sure that it can connect uh, over a wireless network and you can mine either on a wired network or a wireless network. This is DDR4 memory uh, and I prefer the Crucial brand. You can purchase Windows 10 software on a USB stick and install it on as many mining rigs as you like. A 60 gigabyte solid state drive this is the HX1200i power supply, but you can use any uh, gold or platinum rated power supply for your 6 GPU mining rig. The nice thing about using a 1200 watt unit is you can uh, dual mine and uh, you know run a little more power through this than you would if you just had a 1000 watt unit. This is a power button that you can plug into your motherboard. Here we have the PCI Express USB extender, and this just helps your GPUs get elevated from the motherboard so that they stay cool. Here we have the unit partially assembled. We have the power supply unit in the back. We have the motherboard here. The first step is to install the CPU. You can see we've done that here. Next, you'll install the memory, and you can see it there, it just clicks right into place on the motherboard. The powered USB extenders for the graphics cards all plug in on the motherboard here. You can see that the USB is p plugged right in there, and uh, power from the power supply unit is plugged in right there. And then, of course, the GPU drops right into that slot. You can see here we've taken the uh, solid state drive and plugged it in. We've got power, we've got SATA cable that goes to the motherboard, and uh, we've just kind of thrown a quick zip tie on there, uh, anchoring it here to the frame. There's our power button. We have it just zip tied to the frame again, and it plugs directly into the motherboard. Very easy to uh, plug in and then use that to, to turn the unit on. Here we have the GPU, and you can just see how that uh, extender just plugs right in there. And then, of course, we have the auxiliary power plugged into the top of the GPU there. As a quick recap, what we've done is we've installed the CPU and the memory on the motherboard. We've secured the motherboard to the mining rig case. We've plugged in the power supply unit cables uh, to the motherboard and to the various components. We've plugged in the solid state drive using that SATA cable. We've plugged in all of the PCI Express USB riser cables, uh, both to the motherboard and to the GPUs. And we've set the GPUs in place, ready to start mining your favorite cryptocurrency. For more details, go to www.coinminingrigs.com.